Bless up, bless up, bless up. Wagwanova, yes up on RM TV review. Hope everyone doing good as you're watching this right now. So Shensia recently came out in an interview and talked some things. Some of the fans them shock. It's like them never expect Shensia to answer a question like you know something where she never do in the bedroom. What she would like to do? Well, Shensia come out and say. She tried it before, but she would like to do anal. You see me? And we already see Shensia come out. You see me? Talk, we she talk in the song Lick with Meg the Stallion. Some of the fans them get upset. We see some bashing and all of that. Even before that, Shensia done. She be not talk about where she like, you know, her fantasies and them things. That we she talk how she freaky she is. Things where she like get from man. And we see some of the male fans them clap back. You see me? Bashing her. Especially the Jamaican male fans. Yes, people. So. Now when Shensia put this out, we know say some people are going to attack her over social media. Well, to some of us, it's not really surprising based on, you know, how she always express herself when it comes on to freaky things and them things there. You see me? Yeah, people. So, Angela Yee, she going to ask them questions because she always throw it at, you know, artists or whoever she interview she look like for her personal life she into them type of things there as a year where she said in the interview if you watch it you know she tried it before and them are going up all with them type of thing yeah, in the interview however Shensia after she come out and said that she upset a lot of fans we see them a deal with her over social media away, especially some are Jamaican fans because when Shensia just start out, you know, no far fans them never really know about this side of her, you know. It's like no, as a matter of fact, let me show you guys some of the reaction over social media since the video circulating with Shensia, you know, talking about that busting it out in the media what she want in the bedroom you know it's like the fans them already know what she talk about already about lick and them things they bought this is like some of the fans them are deal with her away so check this out right here this person post she doing and saying anything just to sell her album hashtag sad just know shensia gone to the dogs she lose her soul yes people and next post right here this person say i see the bbc Papi one or that fi why out mama till the end a time. Yes, people and next person right here say Bon off that and next comment this person post dirty gal why and next comment this person say no she said no man to her rear <laughs> Yeah people so it's like Shensia go put that out the fans them some fans already a basher Well some of Shensia fans them now have no problem with all of them type of thing yeah, where she sing about and where she a go on with you know it's like some of them up all with it you see it but at the same time some are fans who never know so Shensia stay like this you see me it's like them a bash her and I say all type of things because they know why she go out on the international side and represent Jamaica for all of them thing yeah. but Shensia say some of the man them you know them a hypocrite when it come on to them thing yeah. but you see me Right now, people are say right now Shensia lose it. She just I do this and I try hard for go for get her career mainstream and I try match up with for them type of lifestyle overseas. And we see Futa hype come out already. I talk about it even just the other day. You know, recently this is where we see Futa hype post over social media pertaining to Shensia and address people who are saying that him hate Shensia. Foot type says Shensia right now she talented him na go deny that you know him love her music but she a do too much if go mainstream is like him want she stick to the Jamaica roots and culture and not put up with certain slackness fi get her career out there so check out this what footer hype saying right here but people after that interview let me know what y'all think about Shensia after she got exposed that in the media Shensia album how much time you can answer one question when I ask me if I listen to Shensia album no I'm not listening I hear the song where she 
she drop like a R&B sounding song. Sound good. But she still gone with a nasty something in her body. Lick, lick, me can't deal with it. Me, me can't bother with the name front song them and the suck so song them. Me can't deal with them. Me not really like them something there. Them things they spoil the content of the song. Me just grow different. I just say, man. You understand what I'm saying? Me grow different and me think different. You have other people who like it. You know them I say me not feel like it. Simple, me not feel like it. I don't like it. Once we hear a good song and then it reach to that arm, um, then my crutches um suck my dick like it. Oh. That is the next thing we make me rate artists doing the content. Me can't just get up and rate artists um just because your name I call. Me listen to content, me look how you carry yourself. I look how you um, present yourself on stage, all of them something make me rate artists. You understand? Yeah, so if you ask me about fashion wise and looks and actions, yeah, up top, up top, shall lead. Nothing other than if you compete with that. The only thing we could have given a little competition at Aisha and Aisha and I don't know if Aisha and I still have the music or what. But in terms of the looks and the fashion department and them something there, yeah, shouldn't say up there. But I don't like the song them, the sucking business, and that's not us. I will never ever approve of those things. That's not dancehall, that's not Jamaica. Because she has said no one a dancehall, she has the music for the world. You are Jamaican, you can't erase that. You can't erase that part, they say you are Jamaican. So once they are Jamaican, the burden is going to still come and the pressure is going to still come. You understand what I say? Yes, yeah, so as long as they are Jamaican, because you are in America now, no matter where you do, I'm going to say this Jamaican artist, Shen Yang, you know, Shen Sia, this beautiful Shen Sia from Jamaica, and they are always say that. So you can't go around that. You understand? Can't go around that. Cannot go around that. Cannot go around that. You can't rub out the parts of your Jamaica. You can't take a rubber and a pencil and rub it out. Mm -mm. You have to remember that at all times. No matter, she could have become the biggest thing in the world. Them still like I said, that's Shensia from Jamaica. You know the Jamaican artist Shensia? Yeah, you know that pretty brown girl from Jamaica, Shensia? Yeah. Yeah, she looks like she mixed with Chinese or something, but she's from Jamaica. You can't get away from it. So, because of that now, the bird now got all his dip on you. He uphold the culture of Jamaica, just so you know. You understand? <laughs> See it? Them say our album category is reggae, not hip-hop, not pop. Matter where you do. All of you sing bass souls. They might put your album in a reggae category. You understand? When you know, listen to me, I say, Sally Brown, we are not saying Shensi has ever said she's not Jamaican. But the content of her music is not coincided with Jamaican culture. You understand me, I say? So, I just say, go. I love Shensi, you know. I love Shensi. There's no. I want to eat fish and tea and I uh, me love and I check fish and tea bad, bad, bad. But me just can't agree with the content of the song. Them. You see me? I me think she have way better music than what they have put out. Or she is capable of putting out way better music than what they have put out for her. It's just the truth. You understand? I ain't lying though. And if everybody wish to talk the truth, Shentia can really sing, you know. Shentia can really sing. And Shentia can really do rap, R&B, freestyle, everything. She talented. But I don't know what is wrong with them. You cannot. Let me tell you how oh, crossover thing go. Crossover thing work for we Jamaicans when they just and do music and put them out. You see, when they are target America, it usually never works. 
it usually never works. When you get up and go in a studio and say, all right, we're going to build a song for the urban market in America. Or we're going to build a song for the white audience in America. Or we're going to build a song for the hip-hop community. It never works. They have to just build with them. Artists sing with them spirit I tell them, say. Build next with them. Read them talk to artists. Artists sing with the spirit I tell them. Because the ancestors them work through the spirit. See? You cannot sit on an aki straight where it go because it go against where the spirit I tell you. And once it go against where the spirit I tell you, it's going to be a failed project. Music is not only the practical, you know. Music is not only a man I build a rhythm and you are sing where somebody I tell you to sing. Cause if this rhythm I tell you something else and you put something else on it, it not go work. The rhythm I go vex. It's like you're a cheat on the rhythm.